The Woodstock Shoe Tree is a black walnut tree. Its branches bear at least a hundred different kinds of discarded, decrepit flip-flops, boots, and gym shoes. It sits opposite of a multi-million dollar gated property and is listed as a stop on RoadsideAmerica.com. Wow, this is actually kind of a cool spot. It's the ultimate anti cedo if I ever saw one, where we actually encourage people to throw shoes on this tree and we place the cash here. <laughs> nice shot. Okay, we're road tripping in Illinois and Wisconsin and somebody suggested actually one of our patrons suggested we should come to the shoe tree the shoe where tree is here? bob billy and hailmeister came to and look who we found Hi. the hailmeister we got some shoes Woo. well i brought me my oh, a favorite pair of my shoes but i could only find the the, the left one and I, I just can't squeeze into them anymore that's my favorite shoe. And just, your feet have... Yeah, I broke. <laughs> oh, geez. Yeah, these are definitely yours. <laughs> oh. oh! Oh, that's not good. Oh, that's nasty. <laughs> oh, I was just searching for a tree to visit there, and I found the cache. Just like that. Woohoo! Holy cow. You want it? It's like it. <laughs> no, I don't want it. <laughs> Turn it into a travel bug. It is. It oh, is. it is. It is. Oh, I'll be darned. I brought, I brought my baby shoes here to throw up into the tree. I didn't mean throw up like vomit. I meant to throw up as in toss them into the limbs. But I brought my baby shoes to put up into the tree. Well, here we go. One, two, three. <gasps> Well, that's all the farther I can throw. Found Bob Billy's baby shoes. Maybe we can get them in the tree for him because he didn't have a very good throw. Kind of missed. I tied my little shoe to Bob Billy's baby shoes. And then uh, that'll give some heft to get into the tree. It'll help us both. I'll get my little shoe up there and Bob Billy's baby shoes and maybe I can make contact. All right, ready? One holy. Two holies, three holy doodles. Oh, just as good as Bob Billy. Dang it all. Okay. One Mississippi, two Mississippi, three Mississippi. I'm just as good as Bob Billy. Oh, come on. Perfect. my little shoe inside of Bob Billy's little shoe. It's in a tree, not the big one. Little one nearby. Good enough. First of all, I've chosen a pair of shoes that came from an alien or somebody that lives near a nuclear waste site or something. There's three of them. So. Three of them. The triple threat. All right. He's winding up. He's on the base. He's winding up. He's going for the throw. Woo! Oh. <laughs> that guy knows all right, I guess. Yeah, we can't forget to get the cash. <laughs> Come all this way just to throw shoes? No, we got to get the cash. Well, that was a pretty cool cache. We're glad we came to that. We're glad you invited us that out. That was a lot of fun. Yeah, yeah. it was pretty cool. Um, when did you get this cache? Um, I got it probably about five, six years ago. Six years ago? Wow, it's been here quite a while. And it's going to get another two favorite points. Oh, yeah. Let's pull that down. Ready? Wow, Ding. that's cool. Good. There you go. Favorite points. And I think it's time to go caching. Yeah. All right. You talked me into it. We're right here. That's what we do, right? <laughs> anyway, thanks for joining us. And keep watching. There's more caches to be found. Don't forget to like, 
share and subscribe there you go and ring the also, bell also don't forget yeah ring the bell but subscribe to the hailmeister too oh you thank know, you and not just cash canada anyway where will geocaching take you this cache is good for the soul <laughs> <laughs>